Castaway Keys is another masterpiece of leave. So when he asked me when I wanted to do a zoo tour, I surely couldn't say no. I mean, thanks to him, we also started our Eagle Island Park on this diorama map. So I am honestly just super excited to check out what he did with this map. It has a general tropical island, an Oceania focused island, and it also has a pirate South American theme. I can't wait to explore them all. And if you are excited as well, then please do make sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe of course if you haven't already and stay tuned for more. Hey everyone, my name is The Lady Designer and today we are back with another incredible zoo tour made by the awesome Leaf. If you don't know Leaf yet, he is a brilliant planet zoo creator and modder and he also has his own YouTube channel. So definitely make sure to subscribe to Leaf if you haven't already with the link in the description. And before we jump into it, I would love to thank our fantastic sponsor of the channel Instant Gaming because via their website you can get an amazing discount on Planet Zoo, The Sim, City Skylines 1 and 2, Jurassic World Evolution, Farming Simulator, and so many other great games. And by buying via their website, you will get a great discount and you will also be supporting the channel. You can find a link in the description of this video and in the pinned message of the comment section so you can easily find it. Now without further talking, let's go and jump into Castaway Keys made by Leaf. Okay, we're going to start right over here because this is where the guests enter. So this is where we are going to enter. I mean, I just so much love already what you did here. This is looking so good. Like all these, these pillars here with the tropical pack, they are fantastic. All right, look at this. Oh, I love how you use the signs here. I also really love, I don't know if you guys notice it, but like with the intro, oh, look at them all go. <laughs> but like all the noises of all the animals when you just hovered over the island. Oh my goodness. It, it just really made me jump into this map to explore it all. It's so cool. Look at this, how you made this. <gasps> Even underneath here in the water, that looks so good using all these. Uh, these are the pillars, right? Oh, wait, what? I, I want to know what that is. <gasps> the twilight wall floor. Are you kidding me? I would never think of using that in like a water service, but it looks so good. Oh, wow. I love it. Also really like this sign. Love, the, love everything. Okay, I love everything. <laughs> I'm not gonna say love, 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 love. <gasps> There's even uh, an otter walking around here. Oh my goodness. Look at these guys having so much fun here. It's fantastic. Oh, <laughs> I love it so much. Look at all these. Like, what do we even call it? Like temple ruins or whatever. Look at the waterfall here. Oh, I love how you use these. Like, I've never used them myself yet because I'm just like, yeah, I just don't know where. But this is such a great way of using these, these statue pieces. Oh, my gosh. I, uh, oh, wow. Did you see that jump? I wanted to say I love this area, but I, I really do love. Okay, I, I can't stop saying love, 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 love. <laughs> so good the building here the architecture is so nice okay wait where do we go then because this was a viewing gallery into that are we missing out on anything on this side no we don't except for like just beautiful scenery and beautiful foliage and, and tropical work oh man this is so good i love the like the long grass here like how did you even do that buffalo grass and like put it wait 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 i want to see this oh my goodness okay i'm not going to do this the whole zoo you guys but oh wow what a smart way of adding grass and like making it feel a bit thicker and stuff i'm learning so much here there's so much inspiration in here oh wow okay <laughs> let's go down here i want to go to the left side because i do you think I remember that the left area is made with mostly blueprints? And I'm not entirely sure if it's like blueprints from the community or like blueprints from the game. But I did see a video passing by being like, can you build a zoo entirely out of blueprints? So, and you use this zoo for that. So 
<laughs> not entirely sure, but I want to save like the pirate theme for the, the, the end of the video because I think that's just going to look so freaking good. Man, I really am such a fan of this given how it's had. It's it's from every angle. Like I'm I'm looking from the left to the right to the left to the right because there's just so much to see here. It is so well put together, Leave. I really am such a fan of this zoo already. Also this. Wait, what? They can... W wait, who can, can walk here? What kind of animal is able... Oh, wow. <gasps> this is so good. Are they not able to skip here? I don't know. <laughs> Are they? <laughs> you actually used rope here? I want to know what is able to use this. Look how cool this is looking. <gasps> it's for lemurs. Are you kidding me? Oh, wow. That is so awesome. And so creative. Okay. We, we can... Oh. Oh, this is so pretty. Okay. Let's go through. Wait, is this actually for staff or is this for... Guest. I think this is for guests. Look at the beautiful foliage work, the rock work in here. The climber frames look so freaking good with the bamboo pieces. Oh, wow. Oh, there's another one of those overpasses. You're kidding me. They have a nice water, natural, uh, natural water source. Oh my goodness, I love these these tree huts, I think we can call it. <gasps> Look at this. Wait, do we have... What? The Plumeria flowers. Wait, you can recolor those? When did I miss out on that news? When did that happen? Oh my goodness, that looks so pretty. What a great idea. Oh my gosh, you are so good at using foliage. Like, it's looking so beautiful. Where are we going? Wait, where is the bridge to the other island? J just to be sure. I actually don't know. Um, wait, we're just going to follow this. Wait, what is this? Look at this. Ah, <gasps> there's a white bangle tiger. Oh, this is so gorgeous. That waterfall looks fantastic. I just... What? How did you do that? These are the waterfall pieces from the aquatic pack, right? What a brilliant way of do... Hi, beauty. Oh. <laughs> I love these guys so much. They are so gorgeous. Look at this bamboo wall here. Oh. Oh, there's so much in the, in this zoo that I want to explore, but oh, how you did this with that that tropical tree trunk, which I don't know the exact name of. Even like added these, these, uh, I'm gonna call them mushrooms. I know they're not exactly called mushrooms, I think, but you guys know what I mean. Oh, wow. This is so beautiful. The bamboo. I am so speechless. Like, these are just bamboo sticks, right? Yes, bamboo beams, all thin. Oh, wow. Oh, this is so inspiring, Leaf. Okay, we can we can actually also follow the path right over here. That works so well with all the natural bamboo in front of it. Oh, hello. Hi. <laughs> what are you doing? What is that? What? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure what is, what is happening here. Oh gosh, you're at least stuck. Stuck in the animation. Are you also stuck in... in what? Oh no, you you seem to be alright. I, I, th I think I need to help you real quick here because... Um, <laughs> I feel so sorry for you, Vivan. Or Vi Vivan. Okay, that should go better. But what a gorgeous habitat here. <gasps> oh, and a little restaurant. Oh, I want to eat. What? Oh, I love how you made this thinner here. That looks super nice. I would never think of doing that. Okay, wait. We need to, we need to help some more animals in here. But I would never think of doing this. But that actually looks so nice as well. To just make it like... I think this is one by one or something. That is looking so good. 
Oh, wow. I'm in love with this area. Seriously, this is brilliant work, Leaf. Are you do? Well, okay. We're just going to ignore that. <laughs> okay, so where do we go? Can we go up here? I think we can. Oh, a sun bear sign. Oh, you did it again here. Oh, I love that. Oh, how gorgeous is this? Just look at the rock work as well. Oh, this is so nice. Oh, there is a sun bear here. Are you going to use that? What are you doing? Uh, sun bears are one of those animals that are, I don't know, pretty much so underrated. Or at least an animal you, you don't really see that often in zoo tours. But they're so cute. Look at this little happy face. They really are. Aww. I love it. What a beautiful habitat again. Like the different height elevations and the rock work. And again, like this thicker foliage work is so inspiring. It's so beautiful. They're really like a natural wall right over here. Oh, actually, they're not able to walk here. I thought for a second they were able to walk here. But this is just only a big hole to make sure that they're not able to escape. But you can barely... Oh, I think you did such an amazing job integrating this. It looks so freaking beautiful. They are able to walk here, which I do really love. I also really like the color, the, the, the flowers that you used in this habitat. And there's even a rubbing pillar right over here in the back. Oh, this is so freaking gorgeous. Okay, we have a fossa habitat. Oh, I love this fencing. How did you do that? Wait, I, I cannot even uh, click it. What? What is this? What? What is this? This? Oh, oh. The grasslands animal sign pole? Did I ever see this one? What? The Grasslands Animal Sign Pole? The Grasslands Animal Pack? I'm so confused. What is this piece? The Grasslands Animal Pack did not have pieces apart from signs, I guess. But a sign pole? What? I am so confused here. Wait, wait, you know, oh, can I, wait. I need to go in here and find a sign pole. And I'm just going to, to to make it my favorite because I will definitely forget about this piece. Like what the name will be of it. But oh man, this looks so good. I'm sorry. Sorry. I am just so speechless about this piece. But it, this looks so good as well. Look, you can even look through here. Oh wow. And a gorgeous overpass for them. <gasps> oh, it's from the fossa. Oh, that is such a cool idea. What? I'm so speechless. Is this the staff gate? I just want to see. Oh no, but it is staff entrance. But I thought maybe it was the gate, but I guess the gate is here. Oh, this is also looking so nice. The rock work in here is fantastic. No. <gasps> oh, hi. I I've only made one habitat for these guys, but it was a very short series. So it's so cool to see them. Wow, they're so adorable. <gasps> what? What was that? <laughs> alright, alright, let's continue. But the rocker in here is just so mind-blowing. And I love this overpass. It's so freaking good. The walls here. Also the little fence here from the aquatic pack. Oh man, I love this zoo already. And we've only seen a few habitats. Okay, what do we have? Oh, this is the waterfall that we... S Wait, is this the waterfall from the Gibbons? Yes, it is. With the cool statues on the sides. Just look how gorgeous. I, I have the feeling that I'm, I am missing out on something now following this path. But I'm gonna try and make sure to, to show everything in here. Oh, look at that otter walking around. Oh, wow. I'm in love with the view here as well. It's just, just so stunning, isn't it? Okay, what do we have on this side? <gasps> Wait, what are you meant? Uh, there's a red river hawk. It's also an animal I still haven't made a habitat for. Oh, it's combined with mandrels. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, let me have a look at you. <laughs> I still need to add you guys. 
Oh man, I I need to now. I see you. Oh look at them. Oh, they're so funny. It's so gorgeous. What a fantastic habitat here as well. By the way, I'm sorry I got distracted about the rat paper hog, but like the rock work here with these um, twilight rocks. Oh man. That is so freaking good. That works so well for the edge here in the water. Oh, I love how you use them. And in general, like the rock work with all the roots and stuff right over here sticking out. That looks so good. I want to see you again. Oh, they're so cute. Even though they have the same noises as the uh, warthogs, I do like them a lot. <laughs> I really must build a habitat for these guys soon. Okay, what do we have? Oh man, I love this building as well. It looks so beautiful. Also the fact that you use some mist here to give like this extra touch. Uh, I, I really can't get over it. This is looking so nice. Oh, oh, we have a monitor habitat here. Oh, look how beautiful this underwater viewing looks. Are you going to deep dive for us? Wait a second, what is this? Oh, that's weird. These should be the textures of the monitor swimming here, but they're like underneath it. Wait a second, look at this, how cool that looks. I've never seen this bug or, or glitch before. That is so weird. But man, does this look amazing. Absolutely gorgeous. Do you have the same? No, you don't have the same. So it's... Oh, that is so funny. Oh, I love the root right over here the, from the Twilight Pack. I actually barely used them. I was pretty excited to see them. And then I just barely used them. But this is a great way of using them. Really do like that. This is so gorgeous. Okay, let's continue. What do we have here? Oh, I love that wall as well. The color scheme is so gorgeous have some colorful oh <gasps> you kidding they probably don't work <laughs> these should be like little counters you can put down on the path oh man i love the idea though that looks so freaking good but what is this oh what that's just a sign i for a second thought like that's a billboard and then i was like no i do not have any billboards like that i did not download any billboards i did not get any billboards oh what a cute way of adding these shops we must get those in the game like that would be just so good <gasps> unless like you are a modder you use mods it okay no i thought for a second maybe you added like a vending machine underneath here so guests would still be walking here and get the the stuff okay well you are a modder maybe that is even possible like you can like add vista points and animal talking points oh no i don't want to go here yet underneath the ground and still make them work so does that work with a vending machine as well i mean maybe no one thought about that just yet okay let me just find Find the entrance to the other island so we got so distracted about these tree huts that this is the entrance for this island and as i said like it is created out of blueprints so i'm not entirely sure if it's like only in-game blueprints or a combination of, of of blueprints from leaf because this one is definitely not oh wait that's yeah that's a habitat okay but i mean this one is definitely not in the game as a standard blueprint so a Apologies, I, I don't dare to say that, but maybe Leaf can tell us in the comments down below. Look at this beautiful, beautiful foliage work. This is looking so adorable. Now I'm clicking that, I should not do that. I love this fence here as well, by the way. Also, this archway looks so nice. Now oh, I did not see much. Wait, what is that? Are you kidding me? This is a, what? This is like that swampy tree upside down. You what? That is such a beautiful tree. Well, this is definitely not a blueprint from Frontier. No, I don't see them adding something like that in the game. Oh man, I love that one. Can people download this one from the Steam Workshop? Gosh, this is so beautiful. What do we have in here? Is there like a little sign that I miss? I don't think so. 
Man, this fencing is so cute. <gasps> Quokas! Hello! Hello, happy face. Look, there's one here at the water. You're not able to swim, are you? <laughs> They're so freaking cute! The happiest animal in the world. <laughs> oh man, I love the quokka so much. But what a gorgeous habitat for these guys. Oh, they even have a shelter here underneath the building. Oh, that's so cool. I love this. Oh, there's even one here on the rock. Look at you. <laughs> Oh, I love this building as well, by the way. That looks so gorgeous. Wow. Is this... Wait, did you create this leaf? I'm just going to assume that you did. That these are mostly blueprints that you made. In this theme. I don't know. They're, they're so good. Whoever made them. Oh, man. This is such a beautiful area. Look at those buildings. This is... This is not in-game, is it? Ah, <gasps> look at this wall here. Oh, I really love the combination of the rocks and foliage around here. This is so fantastic. Okay, we go around here. What do we have? Oh, the little blue penguin! Fairy, fairy penguins, right? <laughs> oh, how adorable! Oh, they make such cute noises. <laughs> Hello! Also, an animal did not create a habitat for just yet. <laughs> we must, though. But I don't think they fit in our eco island park. They're so cute. <gasps> Look at this. This is even. Yeah, this is definitely not in game blueprints. It's like a shipwreck. That is so cute. It could actually also work for playground or something. I love it. Oh man, the noises they make are so adorable. All right, let's go. Oh man, the foliage work is so beautiful here. Go around here. Oh, I'm in love with that tree. <laughs> oh, little uh, Monsieur Fleet stands. Looks super nice. And... Another Oceania building. I'm not sure if it has like a purpose or anything. Wait, did, did I hear a Tasmanian devil here? Ah, <gasps> yes! Yes, we do. Look at this. This is so beautiful as well. Love the green foliage around here. And then the, the, the black rocks were actually something that turned me off a little bit because I was like, ah, I don't know if I'm going to use them, but... Actually, how you use them, it looks so freaking good. Do they even have like a little hot spring? Or at least like a little water pool. What? That is so cute. Hello? Oh, what, what just happened there? Why did you... What? what? <laughs> Where are you now? Wait, huh? It just disappeared. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. It's somewhere underneath these rocks, I'm assuming. Oh my goodness. Hi, cutie. <laughs> oh, I really like this habitat as well. But yeah, it's, it's really great to see that these black rocks actually do work super nice. Like, I really wasn't sure. But you are convincing me that I should probably use them for my volcano on the Eco Island Park. I don't know, what do you guys think? Oh, this is looking so nice. I love these rocks here. Like, especially with the little mulch on top of it. That looks so nice. Okay, let's go down. Oh yes, the Kiwi Aviary. Oh wait, 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 this is... Huh? This is a staff gate. Ah, there we are. Now we can look into the habitat. Do you have a little albino one? Look! Oh! <laughs> They're so freaking funny! I love the kiwi so much! You're so adorable! Just look at it walk! 
Oh man, I just can't help it. But this this white one, it's just like cuteness overload. I love the kiwi already in brown, but the white one just tops it off with cuteness. You really are so pretty. Oh, man, what a cute habitat for these guys. And these rock formations, I can't get over it. They look so fantastic. Really great work. Also love the fencing right over here. And the, the, the flowers, man. The flowers definitely do the trick in here with like such a beautiful contrast. But wait, the fig tree doesn't have these flowers. No. Oh, I can't can't click them. But these are the same flowers, right? I, I just wanna I just wanna add them to my favorites list. It was quite hard to, to, to select these guys, but these are the hanging Catlegia orchid flowers or something like that. So I did just favorite them as well, just to make sure that I won't forget. But I just can't get over the fact that they're all recolorable. Like, when did that happen? I'm just so happy to know, but I wish I would have known it sooner. I mean, it's so great that we can recolor, recolor them. Okay, this was the Quokka habitat. So we are now going to the other side, the pirate theme. Going from this beautiful, colorful section to this pirate theme area, which looks so good with the white walls around it. Oh my goodness. Just look at all these flowers. It's such a difference to have recolorable flowers. Oh, look at this. Dipping dots. What a cute counter. <gasps> Pretzels. You kidding? Oh, that is so cute. Hey, you mushroom. Cannons. I was like, wait, since when do we have the cannons? But these are piece by piece. Limestone columns. What? Oh, wow. They look so freaking good. Amazing. Oh, look at these walls right over here. That looks so beautiful. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, I, I love this. This is so cool. Can they actually climb on it? Oh, wow. It looks so beautiful and lush. I am such a fan of this. This is so cool. You did such an amazing job on this leaf. Oh, look at all these cannons here. Oh, wow. I'm so speechless. This is, is so good. <gasps> Oh, I did not expect this, but this is such a smart way of integrating the exhibit for the sloth. Like, it felt super natural. Just like, oh yeah, this is a little area where the sloths live. And not like, oh, you're entering a walkthrough exhibit now. Oh, what a great way of integrating this one. Hello. <laughs> They're just so slow. Like, it's almost like nothing, no one is moving. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Something is moving. <laughs> All right, let's continue here. We can go around it. We have a little uh, kids enrichment item. Oh, this is looking so nice. What a beautiful habitat. All the tropical foliage here. Oh, look at this when the sunlight just hits the walls here and then you have like this beautiful strip rag with all these these beautiful flowers again oh my goodness this is so good oh i see black jaguar here i know okay i should not go here look at the rock work here it's so freaking good look at these barrels hanging here oh <gasps> Oh, I, I almost miss out on them. The American alligators we have in here. What? Oh, that is so cool. Oh, man. I love this. Uh, what is it called again? The periwinkle. Do I ever use them? Like, this is the, <laughs> the periwinkle flowers. The Korean is a kind of... I don't know how you call that in English. Like a, like a mossy vibe on your water. This is so beautiful. Just look how this is looking. It's so realistic and scary. Oh man, oh, I love this zoo. All right, let's go to that black panther or black jaguar habitat. <gasps> oh, this is also really nice. 
an area you would see a lot where kids would play around, I think. What a cute area. I love it. And it's like so many trees, like the fig trees inside of each other making one big tree. Wow, that is so beautiful. I, it's so inspiring, Leaf. I just can't get over it. Oh, wow. I love that they have a little bit of shallow water here to play with or to play in and cool down. Just look how gorgeous. This is the other side of the ship, right? Oh my goodness. Did you create the ship? It looks so freaking good. Like jaw-droppingly good. Wow. I, I want to see the other side again. And I love how you integrated this with like some hay bennings, like a little bit of a shelter area. But the green, like, ah, oh, it's so, so freaking good. Also here, the green hanging down. Aw, oh, man, I just love it. And I just, in general, love the fact that you have a themed area. Like, it's not, in, in, apart from, like, the themes that we have in game, like the architecture themes, this feels more Disney-themed to me. And I just really like it. It's not super often that we see these heavily themed areas like this. So big props to you, Leaf, because you did an outstanding job with that. But um, I was actually... Oh, like, guests can actually go in here. I was actually thinking, like, this is probably the last bit of the area. Let me just quickly check the uh, animals list. It's not habitat that we missed out on, but there is one capybara in the capuchin monkey habitat, which we almost missed out on walking around here as well and enjoying this habitat. I do like it that you have one capybara in here. Hi, beauty. This unfortunately was the last animal and all the habitats that we've seen of castaway keys. Thank you so, so much, Leaf, for sending this awesome zoo to us for showcase on the channel. I absolutely loved it. It was so much fun to explore and so original and so inspiring. Thank you so, so much for all the great ideas that you gave us for this zoo tour. Everyone, please leave something nice for Leaf in the comments down below and do make sure to subscribe to his channel if you want to see more of leave and let us all know in the comments down below what was your most favorite part of the zoo i really would love to know leave a like at the video if you guys enjoyed it and subscribe of course if you haven't already and yeah i just really do hope to see you guys on the next one thank you guys so much for watching bye guys